Printing on the Konica Minolta BizHub. First of all, open the document you're ready to print, choose File, Print, and choose the appropriate printer. At that point, hit Printer Properties and all the settings will come up. This machine has it defaulted to color two-sided, and here's the options right here. So if I do want to change something, I can just change it to one-sided, I can change it to do grayscale, which will do the black options. At that point, if I hit OK and print again, it's going to print that single-sided um, black and white. If I do come back into the printer options, I can save these settings if it's something that I use all the time. So turn on the setting that you want. There's an option up here by the favorites, and you can say add, and you save that. In this case, I'm going to call this black and white one-sided. Oops. Um, at that point, you can go ahead and save that setting and use it for a later time by just selecting from the favorite settings and choosing the black and white one-sided. If I start here at the default setting, it will go back to the factory default of two-sided color. I've now made a shortcut to something I do often. As far as other settings, they should all be on the different tabs across the top. The My tab is just shortcuts to those other features. So on My tab here, I have a staple option. I can choose to two-side or do booklets in there, and I can choose a couple other options. But I don't have every option here. If I need those, hover your mouse over the other tabs, and it's going to tell you what's there. So for example, the stamp option has an option to do a page number on it. If I go to the basic tab, this is where you can choose the paper trays. So you can come from here and, for example, choose the bypass tray, and you could then choose the bypass tray option. Um, I can choose a few other features here, the output method. If you say save in user box, this is where I can save that option to a box. What I'll do is put the box number that I do want to send it to, name the document if I want, and hit OK, and it will put it into the box for a confidential print job. Um, if you want it to print, just go ahead and choose to print. Some of the other options, the layout tab has another section called combine. You can do four in one, for example, on there. And if I just want to start all over again, I can come up here and just clear everything out. For example, I like the black and white one-sided to go back to. Quality is where you can choose the color option. So choose the auto color uh, for the options. There's a few other choices. There's a full color option that gives you some other ch options as far as printing and some quality adjustments that are in there as well.